I have a client who consults with me on a regular basis and he's always looking for something to, to validate what I tell him because you know although he's been with me a lot and most of what I in his words not mine most of what I tell him comes true <clears throat> maybe not everything um, but that could be perspective so I'm with him not too long ago and we're talking and getting a lot of stuff for, for him about particular um, situation he's involved with and this person's mother comes to me all the time very close to his mother uh, a lot of history with his mother with me on you know on, from the other side so I asked him I said um, is your mother real close with your wife he said yeah actually they were I said yeah I'm seeing that I said you know what is your wife an artist he said, yeah. I said, does she have a big studio? And I described the studio. He says, yes. I said, but, I th but now I, I see her painting. She's wearing a big floppy hat, and your mother's watching her paint. Yeah, maybe. She's always painting. We leave it there. <clears throat> Day later, I get a phone call. You're not going to believe this. I was telling my wife what happened. And when we were talking, at the very moment I was talking about her with that big floppy hat, sitting outside painting, she was at that moment. His mother was letting me know, I mean, she, she, by the way, his mother lets me know all the time that they're with him through various things, you know, whether I see something in the kitchen going on or whatever. But his mother let him know, I guess he was being really skeptical as usual he's a tough client but that's okay i don't i don't like easy it's good um mother let him know she's there she's with his wife at that point so they they're you know be confident that they're there you might not always feel them they'll let you know sometimes when something will happen uh, you'll know who it is, you'll, or you get the feeling. It's, there's never any certainty. Look, there's no science behind this. There's no papers. There's no studies. Okay. Um, I wish there were. I, I, <clears throat> I'll tell you a story about a psychiatrist or psychologist that, that hired me one day. It may already be up on here, so I want to look it up. Anyway, he started screaming at me about you know studies and stuff. So anyway, guys. You've got to have faith that the souls are with you because they are. And they're going to be watching out over you. And they will open doors and close doors for you. It's just up to us to go through them. We'll get the feeling this is what we need to do. And when you get that feeling, do it. Always remain hopeful. Never hopeless. Always be optimistic. Never pessimistic. Please like this video. Follow me if you aren't already, and leave a comment down below. I always appreciate that. Have a great day. Only way to live.